<laughs> Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. As we move into the third year of Sister Circle, uh, we thought it's important that we reflect, we reflect on some amazing memories we've made so far and celebrate how our time here has helped elevate us personally and professionally. Well, first up, we have Rashawn Ali. Oh, Let's take a look. <laughs> This path did not happen overnight, and that's why, you know, when I talk to young young people, especially young women, like, hey, I want to do what you do, and I'm just like, don't forget the hard work. Kanye West is in the building with Let's Show Us a Love, HM. Yeah. Yeah. I got into radio at 26 years old and uh, had the amazing opportunity to work 12 years in radio, but television was always the long goal. But I didn't really see how that was going to happen. I mean, I had my opportunities with NBA TV, CNN, Headline News, CBS Sports Network, but none of those things truly fulfilled me. I was always kind of like the bridesmaid and never the bride when it came to television because I had done so much work in television, but nobody would like make me their girl. All right, Rashawn, count yourself right. in. And three, two, one. Welcome back to the Sister Circle. We're so glad that you have decided to join us today. We are very, very excited about our show. We've got a litany of topics. I started uh, researching and started really studying The View and studying Wendy, but then I wrote down in my journal, I said, I wanna be on a show where I can really show who I am every single day with somebody doing my makeup, hair, and wardrobe. Literally wrote that down two years prior to me getting a text saying, hey, there's a new show that they're casting for. And I was like, okay, you know, when you're in this business, you get cast for so many things, or you audition, you're like, oh, it's not gonna happen. And literally, that was just kind of the attitude I had for Sister Circle, especially in the very beginning. I didn't really believe it until we walked out on the set on September 18th, 2017. Do you Sister miss radio? Life. Every now and then I think about radio. Yeah. Yeah, but this is where I wanna be. Yes, TV. So, yeah, TV is it. I know individually I'm being used and I know collectively we are being used for a greater cause and speaking my truth uh, just allows for other people, I hope, to, to feel that type of impact. I had one bad mistake and it really made my first two days of the week horrible hmm. because that was based on me and when I went to my therapy session, she was like, you're so kind to everybody else. You need to allow those same liberties for yourself. You gotta go back. So that you can become the best version of yourself, you gotta go back and realize what made you this person. So you can deal with those things, overcome those things, and so that you can be better. Some things my mother still doesn't even know about that I went through or, or just faced on my own because I just did not want, want to disappoint her. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yeah. and my dad too. I think Sister Circle has made me better as a woman because of those special pieces, because of the conversations, because of the relationships that I have with the host and with members of the production crew. Like, I've been able to really grow. It is good, Mommy, mm -hmm. that we can spend Mother's Day together. You know, life is short. You gotta savor the moments. You're not gonna cry, are you? <laughs> no, man. After the sister cam with my mom and I, that's what opened me up for therapy. It opened me up to be to be transparent with her, to be transparent with myself, to be transparent with my daughter. It has made me better. When you are grateful in what you have now, it only sets you up for what you desire. I just feel like when all is said and done and I've discovered like truly who I am, it's gonna be magical. Cause it already is a little piece of magic right now. Try it. Come on, five, three, 125, who wants up? It's all good, so. And then so. you want to be around, you're like, what, $50? I'm about to screw you. 136, because I think I was late on the last one. Jambolite se timota. Hey, jambo, jambo. Jambolite se timota. I like collard greens oh. with some hot sauce on it. I like turkey in that thing, and you know I be on it, yeah. Hey. Hey. I'm just way more comfortable with who I am at my core. And so that showing on air is uh, it's important to me because if you can't be truly who you are, then who are you? And so they get to see that, all of it. No one's talking about Thank you. That was great. That was all the boy. Yes, that was. 
comprehensive. You did that, Sheree. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that whole crew that yeah. helped make that come together. Oh, yeah, they did excellent Michael, job. Raphael was in there. Glenn, appreciate the you, man. <laughs> Makeup. Uh, what's up, Jay Knight? Why I take you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and most importantly, uh, God. But ladies, we get to do this together. Yeah, we do. And they get we to do. showcase us all week. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's too fun. It's just gonna be fun. It's gonna mm -hmm. be fun. So we're continuing our year three, uh, just happiness. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And thanks to our whole crew, we have a great team here. We'll be right back. Yeah, that was a good one. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. That was like, I 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 was like, I